Okay, so this is the um, question to graph the conic. So we got this equation in standard, I mean, in expanded form. We got to convert it to uh, standard form, and this is the equation right here. So from this equation, we know that this is a horizontal, um, horizontal, um, the conic because of this equation, uh, it follows this formula, which is y minus k squared equals 4p x minus h. So first, what we have to do is find the vertex. And we know that to find the vertex, you have to do h, k. So based on this equation, again, we know that we can find the h and k. We know that negative h equals plus 2 and negative k equals plus 3. So we know that the vertex equals negative 2 and negative 3. So we graph that this point right here. And then because it is horizontal, we know that it can go either this way or this way. But how we find that it goes to the left is by finding the focus. And to find the focus, we use this equation, h plus p, p, uh, k. And so we know that h and k, so we put that there. And then p, we, what we do is that we go back to this equation. We know that negative 8 equals 4p, and we find that p equals negative 2. And so when we put this all into the equation, we get negative 4, negative 3. So then we also graph this point. So now we know because it's horizontal and the vertex is negative 2, negative 3, and the focus is negative 4, negative 3, we know that it has to open this way. And uh, the next step is we can find the director axis. So we know that the vertex, I mean the focus, the vertex, and the directors have to be, director axis have to be equal distance. So, and we all can also do this equation, which is x equals h minus p. So we get x equals 0. So we get the director axis right here. And the axis of symmetry, we know that y equals k, so we can, um, we know that k equals negative 3 based on the vertex, and we can also uh, graph this. So that is our graph for our, for this equation.